Now I'm going to show you how to use Google Earth and uh, PowerPoint and some useful things it's good for, um, especially in the technical field, uh, doing uh, doing different shots of the Earth. Um, typically, you download Google Earth uh, from Google. Uh, if you uh, go to their website and just type in Google Earth, they'll provide you the uh, software to download. It's pretty small. I already have it open here, so we'll go ahead and use it. Uh, today, we're going to take a look at uh, we'll do Nellis Air Force Base uh, in Nevada. As you can see, it's zooming in. And this base is just north of Las Vegas. It's uh, a lot of action happens in the Air Force. Now, some of the cool things we can do here um, we can obviously take a uh, screenshot. Um, you can do that right now. We can go. Uh, First, let's take off. Uh, let's take off any type of any type of. Okay. Let's see. Let's get the actual. Button. Okay. So we can do a print screen, and we can slap it on the slide by Control V, which is the paste. Pop it real quick. tools in here that they have. Uh, there's a ruler um, that you can figure out how long how long is this runway. Let's take a look. We go point to point. It gives us uh, 1.86 miles and you can do the conversions to figure out how many feet that is. Um, so that's a neat tool you can do. It kind of sets there. You can, uh, you can set a path. Let's say you want to some waypoints. It'll give you a path, so you can use that for running and trying to figure out a perimeter. Um, so the path stuck there for now. There's also even a way um, you can add grid lines, uh, bo boxes on here. Uh, there's lots of different things you can do. Um, one of the cool features of Google Earth is uh, the flight simulator. Let's see if this works. Um, so now I'm in Google Earth and I'm actually flying around in a Cessna. And you can control it. And if you go to Google and you type in Flight Simulator, I have all the different controls. And you can actually even hook up an external joystick to fly around. The resolution's not very good right now because uh, I'm running this video capturing software to show you this. Um, but we're going to end the simulator right there. So that's that's a neat way to get a good perspective. Also, uh, there's some other useful things. If you right-click and use the right mouse button, you can get a kind of different views of the area you're looking at. You can kind of fly around like that. Um, so there's lots of useful things that Google Earth use in PowerPoint, but uh, those are the ones I'll share with you today.